All right, so in this video, let's take a look at <clears throat> finding the derivative using uh, the quotient rule. And uh, these are going to be rational expressions, and uh, the uh, numerator and denominator is going to be polynomials. I'll get a video up with the quotient rule with uh, trig functions, and, uh, and probably another video with some all kinds of functions mixed mixed in together. All right. <coughs> so let's look what does the quotient rule say? Okay, so we've got the derivative of f over g, okay, with respect to x. So here's our quotient, f's the numerator, g's the denominator. So the quotient rule says it's the derivative of the numerator times the denominator minus the derivative of the denominator times the numerator and all that over the denominator squared. All right, so it's important here that you, get, you have to make sure that you do the derivative of the numerator first times the denominator and then minus the derivative of the denominator times the numerator because you don't want to have these switch because then your sign will be wrong. All right, so let's let's take a look at a couple of examples. All right, so here's our first function. I have f of x equals x over x plus 1. So let's take the derivative of this. So the derivative Okay, it's going to be the derivative of the numerator, so the derivative of x is 1, times the denominator, which is x plus 1, minus the derivative of the denominator, which is 1, the derivative of x is 1, and the derivative of 1 is 0. Let me see if I can write that one a little bit better. Okay, so the derivative of x is 1, derivative of 1 is 0, times the numerator, which is x. And that's all over the denominator squared. Alright, so let's clean this up a little bit. Uh, distribute the 1, so that's going to be x plus 1 minus, and then 1 times x is x, over x plus 1 squared. So I get f prime x is equal to, okay, so the x's go out, and I'm left with 1 over x plus 1 squared. And there's our derivative. All right, so let's take a look at one more. All right, so here I have f of x equals x squared minus x over x squared plus 1. All right, so the derivative is going to be the derivative of the numerator. So the derivative of x squared is 2x minus, and then the derivative of x is 1. So there's the derivative of the numerator times the denominator, x squared plus 1, minus, and then we have the derivative of the denominator, okay, so the derivative of the denominator, derivative of x squared is 2x, and then the derivative of 1 is 0, so there's the derivative of the denominator times the numerator, x squared minus x and that's all over the denominator squared. So I get f prime x is equal to, so here I'm going to fold this out, so I've got 2x times x squared is 2x cubed, and then 2x times 1 is plus 2x, and negative 1 times x squared is minus 
x squared and negative 1 times 1 is negative 1. Okay, so I fold this out and then I'm going to distribute the minus 2x. So that's going to be minus 2x cubed plus 2x squared over the denominator squared. All right, so let's see what happens here. So I get f prime of x equals, <coughs> okay, you can see the 2x cubes, they go out. And so now I have, let's see, negative x squared plus 2x squared is going to give me x squared and then plus 2x minus 1 over x squared plus 1 squared. And this would be our final answer. So I hope this video's helped and I hope you'll check out my other videos. Alright, thanks.